Guess what? I have a ticket to Iran, Iran, e e So new for me, I'm not used to this massive, like a fairy tale land. <laughs> There's a lot of breaking records here for me. Really going outside my comfort zone. Sorry? I don't hear you, sorry. morning all my beautiful people i hope you're doing well me and sarek we are heading to the grand mosque we're leaving abu dhabi so on the way out i will go to the grand mosque and have a look at that and then we go towards dubai dubai i never been there uh know a lot of people a lot of my friends been there but i never so uh, it's gonna be interesting to see apparently like a fantasy world so <laughs> yeah but first of all grand mosque let's go for that It's opening at, what did you say, 9 o'clock for visitors. And I can't wait that long. Anyway, it looks spectacular. Spectacular. Wow. Incredible building. And where am I going now? There you see it. Oh, so nice. Hmm, I'm not sure where I'm going. <laughs> so I took two loops in the roundabout now, so I should probably get out. Ha! Ah, I think this is the one of the most beautiful mosques I've seen. Oof! It's very, very spectacular. <laughs> wow! A little food for my darling. Hello, Hello good morning. Uh, 95 and full tank, please. Do you have a supermarket inside? No, nothing. <laughs> That's okay. This Karen inside. Ah, okay. Exactly. There I can find it. Very good, thank you. So we have one full baby, which is Sarek. Then we need to find something for me along the way. But Dubai is not that far away. It's only one hour and three minutes to the place where I will stay. I will stay in a, in a hostel for only ladies. So yeah, it seems really nice and had very good reviews. So, yeah, the only thing is with the parking, I don't know where to park her. And uh, I think it's like, I don't know, it's pretty expensive to park her per day. So, <laughs> we will see. Hopefully just on the pedestrian street or somewhere. Right, 
to be doing the same thing as yesterday. Iced avocado. And this one is a cheese and parsley thingy. Or thingy. So let's go for that. We have a cat. Okay. He's living in Havana Cafe. <laughs> Let's go to Dubai. <laughs> yep, I'm soon in Dubai, which is here. But then I zoom out and I see my journey. <laughs> Wow. I'm gonna go all the way here. <sighs> Amazing. Okay. Dubai. I would live somewhere close to Paul Jumeirah. Which I don't know what it is. I think there are like hotels around resorts around this place. <laughs> but I'm going there. So what do I actually know about Dubai? I know it's like a fantasy land. <laughs> it is a city, it has an old town, which it has a seven star hotel. I think that's the first thing we heard in, I heard in Sweden, that the first seven star hotel is built in Dubai. Uh, what else do we have there? They have uh, some ski slopes in a building there, so you can ski. <laughs> and uh, outside of Dubai, there are many, many islands, which is a shape of the world, the world map. And all these islands, all these islands are countries, are named after all the countries in the world. So there are actually one island there called Sweden. <laughs> yep. And uh, you can buy an island. You can buy one of those islands. To live there or whatever you want. <laughs> Else with Dubai, 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 Dubai. They have the tallest building in the world. Yes, that as well. Otherwise, we gotta explore. <laughs> it feels really westernized. People from all over the world are here. A lot of expats. <laughs> I see women on the street without any cover. It's pretty nice to see actually. I miss seeing the women. I feel so small compared to all these buildings. <laughs> Whew, it's humid. I will take a shower when I get to the hostel. It's way too early, it's just nine o'clock, so I don't know if I can check in, but probably use the, the common space, common areas. First impression uh, is like, whoa, <laughs> where am I? I will stay in that door, there's the hostel, and I think I'm breaking many records because I'm sweating like a pig. I think I never sweat this much in my life, I think I never experienced this heat I'm doing. There's a lot of breaking records here for me. I like that though. <sighs> really going outside my comfort zone to be this sweaty and stinky. <laughs> What an experience. <laughs> I mean, it's not that warm outside. It's like 35, 36. It's just the humidity. It's like. So, okay, let's go and park my baby. She is parked right there. 
but he said there's no fee when I park here and I got the information it's gonna be 50 50 AED so I don't know I'm a little bit scared and I'm gonna get a fine or something I hope not because he was the security guy so it should be all right anyway she's standing next to a Kawasaki here so now I'm gonna go in and I will take the coldest shower in the world <laughs> and wash my clothes and rest a little bit I think well, this is very nice hanging here hello <laughs> Then we're gonna go to the 16th floor. 16th floor. It's very nice in there. So, so nice. Here we go. Into the cool elevator. And 16. Beautiful people, I hope you're doing well. Fixing, packing, going. I'm leaving Dubai and I'm going to Sharjah and there I will book my ticket towards Iran. So we'll take a boat that goes from Sharjah to Bandar Abbas. So I'm going there now early in the morning to book the ticket and arrange everything there. So let's do that. Let's get out of this garage and do a little bit of exploring while we go outside. Uh, I don't know if I can go out this way. Ah, sorry. I go there? Okay, thank you. <coughs> Little bit reverse. Sorry? I don't hear you, sorry. Are you military? No, 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 no. I'm just a traveler. <laughs> I'm just a traveler. Yes. I look like a military. Ah, yeah, maybe it depends. And the <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> Military. <laughs> uh, wait, 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 exit, 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 where am I going? I'm doing all the wrong ways. <laughs> Very good. I'm getting lost here. The place I'm going to is called Palm Umerian. Let's do it. Well, well, this is the end, the tip of the, the junction, the Palm Junction. Huh? Uh, let's see. Yep. Nothing interesting like that. <laughs> but it was cool to ride on it, at least once in my life. So this is how it looks like. You have uh, two of them actually. You have the Palm uh, Jebel Ali and you have this one, Palm Jumeria, not Palm Junction, as I said. Palm Jumeria. 
I hope you can see something. But this, this is not natural. It's made by human beings. So, yeah. This one, that one. And where is the world map? Uh, I can't find it now. Is it this one? Yeah, there's the world map. All made by human beings. <laughs> I think it's mostly for residential living here. Tell me if I'm wrong. But this, <laughs> yeah. Let's get one of those and live there. Yeah. Yep, that's the one I'm visiting from the outside. I'm not allowed to go in. I need to have a reservation for that building. It is the hotel. The Seven Star Hotel. Burj Al Arab. And the hotel stands on an artificial island. It's one of the tallest hotels in the world. And 39% of its space up there is nothing. It's just space, basically, to make it the tallest one. But yep, this is the hotel. I think this was the first building I heard of in Dubai. Everyone was talking about it. Ooh, the seven star hotel, I remember. And uh, we always made jokes that we we're gonna invite each other when we won on the lottery to go to Dubai to the seven star hotel. <laughs> yep. Anyway, next destination. Let's go. So where from Pakistan are you? I'm Multan. Multan, yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah, I'm looking forward for Pakistan. It's gonna uh, be super interesting. Cool. Yeah. But yeah. Now, for the, our city is very uh, hot. <sighs> yep. In the, like 45 temperature. But yep. if you will enter in Islamabad, mm. and you have to go to Gilgit, Sawad, Gilgit, uh, Kardu. Exactly. And uh, Babu Sartab. Yeah. And uh, Chitral, there is a good weather. It will be like zero temperature. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for, to go to the to the mountains and the yeah. cold up there. I used to have to go through Baluchistan with the escort. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what is around Dubai? How is it Dubai? It's interesting. It's very big, tall buildings. It's so new for me. I'm not used to this massive, like a fairy tale land. <laughs> so interesting. Very nice, I must say. Great. Thank you so much, man. Welcome. What's your name? My name is Salim. Salim. Yeah. Very nice to meet you. May I help you? It's okay. I'm going to my next destination. Oh, okay. Thank you, dear. There we have it. The tallest building in the world, 828 meter tall. <laughs> I don't know how much space is used up there, you see the end of it. Plan now is to go to Sharjah and to book my ticket, the boat ticket. So I get it done and after that I find a new place to stay somewhere around here I think, in Sharjah. Here it is. I'm going to the office and cross my fingers that they have a ticket for me and that everything works well. Whew. So they only take cash in there so I had to run to an ATM and the first one didn't work was out of order so I had to run to this one. But now I have it and I'm gonna pay them. It's almost 600 dollars to cross the sea it's pretty expensive uh, especially with a vehicle but that's my only option so I will go and enjoy that ride guess what I have a ticket to Iran Iran I -I Iran <laughs> the only issue is that I'm arriving on a Friday with a boat going on Thursday taking 12 hours and then I then I arrive on a Friday so the custom will be closed apparently on Fridays so I have to leave my bike there and then come the day after and pick her up but that's okay That's 
a pretty nice room. <laughs> oh, it's brilliant. And I have a balcony. Oh, look. Well, see you. <laughs> there is Sharia. Sharia. I'm closing immediately. Keep the heat outside. Ah, oh, this is so nice. Oh, I have a ticket to Iran. I'm going to Iran. So next episode, you will see me going on a boat across the sea to Iran, Pandarabas. <laughs> I'm so excited and nervous. <laughs> anyway. Thank you so much for joining my adventure from Sweden to Nepal. Like, share, comment, subscribe and join my Patreon family as well. There's more behind the scene and exclusive material there. Take care and I see you soon.